The main goal of the medications you'll be taking during your cycle is to stimulate multiple eggs to grow in both ovaries over the course of approximately 10 days. These medications are commonly known as Folistim, Gonalef, or Menopure, and you'll often be on a combination of two of these medications. During the process, you will also be taking a medication to prevent you from ovulating while the eggs are growing. This could be called Lupron, Ganarelix, or Cetratide. Once your follicles reach a certain size on ultrasound, telling us that the eggs inside are reaching maturity, you'll be instructed to take one last injection which helps with final egg maturation. The timing of this injection, known as the HCG trigger shot, is particularly crucial because it dictates the exact time of the egg retrieval. Trade names for the HCG trigger we use are Pregnil or Novarel. Once you start on the injectable medications, monitoring begins, which is important to ensure your highest chance of success and minimize your risk of getting too bloated or overstimulated. This consists of blood work and ultrasounds, and a typical cycle would require four to six monitoring appointments over the course of 10 days of the injectable medications. Once your follicles reach the right size on ultrasound, we will tell you how and when to take your trigger shot, and your egg retrieval will typically fall 36 hours later. A vaginal ultrasound is performed to visualize the follicles, and once anesthesia is administered, a needle attached to the ultrasound probe is carefully inserted through the side of the vaginal wall to reach the ovaries, where the fluid is aspirated from each follicle. Each follicle typically contains one egg, although an egg is not always retrieved from every follicle. The follicular fluid is passed straight into the embryology lab where the eggs are separated from the surrounding fluid and counted. By the time you leave the office, you'll have a report on the number of eggs retrieved.